Hello, my name is Sonam Bean, and today I would like to create a Quarkus project and deploy it to and deploy it to OpenShift, or deploy the application to OpenShift. And for that purpose, I would like to start with uh, the uh, Quarkus plugin and create a project with the name Quarkus OpenShift, or short Q Shift, Q Shift, and Q Shift. And the version is okay, and the resource is okay. The path is perfect, and I have to switch to to the folder. And uh, I would also like to delete the tests because they just think slow things down for now and we don't really need them for now. Okay, Maven package should uh, create a project and um, we can run Quarkus with a target and runner. It should start, it works. And with curl, localhost, 8080 slash uh, I think hello so we see hello from Quarkus so this is how it works and now I would like to deploy that to uh, um, to OpenShift what Quarkus come with is a docker file and I would like just to uh, open this in an editor and uh, first uh, I would like to change the the uh, output here hello OpenShift so we see the difference and uh, also, I would like to expose a port. And uh, this is needed because I would like to use the Docker file, which comes with uh, Quarkus. And I would like just to expose the port 8080. So this is the only modification. I think uh, now looks better. So what to do is, um, so first, this is my OpenShift project, uh, Airhex project, and I would like to start or create a new build and strategy is the docker strategy and the uh, docker file is from standard in then the code resides in the current folder i think uh, and the name is uh, q shift and uh, i this is um and the docker file is from standard input so what i have to do is to to source main docker to so I have to uh, to, how to, to to stream the Docker file to the standard input, and this is um, the command. So if we switch to builds, uh, we will see that cool shift um, is started. And uh, what I uh, have to do is now to start a build, OC start build from there, and this is my current build, and the name of the build is Q shift, and now we see. It's running, so we can take a look what happens actually inside. So um, it is already successful. So the uh, the build is running, and now we have to create an application from that. And this is O um, and this works with OC new app uh, Docker. Uh, sorry, image stream. And the image stream is Airhex because it's the name of my project, and Q Shift. This is the name of the image latest. And uh, the name is going to be Q Shift. So let's do this. And now we should have an application here running to be used. And it's almost done. What I will have to do is to expose the service Q Shift. Q Shift. And uh, now it's exposed. And what I could do is describe the route Q Shift. And this is my route. So what it basically means, now it should already work, curl. So this is uh, should be the response from, uh, from Quarkus. And this hello should return hello. And we see the old hello because, um, because, so, and then rerun the build, and this is start build. So now it builds. So it's going to be replaced, and now we should see the uh, hello open shift. Hello open shift. And um, what I can do is um, I can uh, scale the C uh, Q shift 
and let's say I would like to have re replicas three. And I get three replicas, and this is actually fairly quick. quick. So if we take a look at the pods, they are the um, pods, and um, they are already ready to go. If this takes a little bit, it can be uh, this address has to be resolved in the internet, and this um, the performance here is depending in my development mode from the uh, performance of the NIPIO uh, website. So thank you for watching. See you at Airhacks and enjoy micro, Lean MicroProfile and Quarkus uh, on OpenShift and so Kubernetes. Whatever we do should also run on Kubernetes. So thank you and bye.